Hi everybody, I'm Jess Coverley. I'm a Pilates instructor and a physiotherapist with over 15 years experience. And I also am passionate about women doing resistance training. Now that could be body weight, okay, or small weights like we use in Pilates, or that might be going to the gym and putting some serious weight through your body. But I really like to encourage women to not be scared about weight, to not feel like they're gonna get bulky because it takes a lot of testosterone for that, okay? Building muscle is optimal for looking toned and shaped like the way most women want to look. It also is going to make you strong and then empower you so that you can lift everything rather than getting a man to do it. And also, it just feels great. It's great for your joints. It's going to make you live longer. So I really like women to add a bit more weight to their exercises. But today, I want to talk about glutes, okay? And building a shapely bottom and having glutes which is really vital for a strong back, for great running technique, and looks really good in your jeans as well. So, um, and most women want, want glutes, don't they? So I'm gonna talk about my three favorite glute exercises. Now with glutes, again, you want to put some weight through them. And if you're not doing that, you're not gonna build the muscle. You have to build some muscle on your glutes to get the nice shape to the bottom that you want. And so you also need to be eating enough to grow muscle. So if you're always on a diet, or you're always in a calorie deficit, it's very unlikely that you're gonna be able to build the glutes. You wanna eat enough calories and especially enough protein to grow those bottom muscles. Now the major muscle of the bottom is obviously the glute max, which is the big one, okay? And you can work different parts of it, but my favorite exercise for the glute max, okay, is your squat. So if you're not squatting on a regular basis, add that to your routine. And we do loads of squats um, in Pilates. You can hold weight, you can do it in the gym with the weight on your back. But if you're not squatting, you're missing out on a brilliant exercise to build those glutes, okay? My second favorite exercise to grow your glutes is a deadlift of some sort, okay? Maybe a sumo deadlift, maybe a straight leg deadlift, depends on whether you want to focus on your hamstrings or your glutes. Now working your hamstrings as well as your glutes gives you marvelous looking glutes because the hamstrings insert up into the glute and almost gives it a shelf for the bottom, okay? so. Doing some form of a deadlift is my number two exercise. And my number three, if I was only gonna do three exercises, would be a hip thrust. And this is where you lay on your back and you lift your hips up and um, ideally against resistance. Now you can start with body weight, but I like people to add some resistance and that might be a band around the knees. I really like that because it shapes the side of the glutes. That's called your glute mead. And there's loads of brilliant glute bead exercises if you want to shape the side of the glutes, but that's for a different, a different video. So the hip thrust with a band across the knees and a weight is a great third exercise for shaping the glutes. And it's a really nice, safe exercise as well that you can do anywhere. If you want to see what these exercises look like, look out for my next video because I'm going to demo all three and give you an idea of how often and how much and how many repetitions you should do.